Hello everyone, it's Open House Thursday on Your View. Welcome to the show. I am Mariah Afolabi Brown. As always, I have my co-host here. Hi ladies. Hello, Hi. Mariah. Hello, Mariah. Some great tea, YK. Cheers. Cheers. Fantastic. <laughs> What's the name of that oh. guy that I gave you yesterday again? Tea. Tea. Okay. 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 This is some ah, good stuff. I'm this is some you. good stuff. This is like, ah, I'm in heaven. I oh, feel like they'll be God. cheating us. All this nonsense we'll be drinking. I had it for dinner yesterday. It's fantastic. fantastic. Well we have to beg Timmy to please make it local so ah. that we can purchase in Nigeria. You only export, right? Yeah. I Don't think you had a good idea putting that lemon. What? Mm. How are you doing, YK? I'm fine, thank you. I'm just enjoying the tea. <laughs> <laughs> Let me jump over to uh, Jumoke. How are you doing? I'm good. Very, nice shoes. Thank you very kindly. My auntie got them for me. I'm very excited about the new month. Um, is business was good. Oh, so it's, it's, it's June 1st, oh, actually. Oh, sugar, death. Time, I didn't yeah. realize the new month. It's the anniversary of my uncle's death, from Kukoye, oh. oh. former minister. Oh. Oh. May he continue to rest June in peace. Amen. Mm. Amen. Amen. So we're just looking ahead to a good um, business month. Pretty much. Good stuff. Hmm. Madam, how you doing? <laughs> I'm very well low. Apart from um, treating malaria and so many things, we're good. Yeah. I just wanted to mention that... Um, so many things? What are you treating? <laughs> Apart from malaria? <laughs> oh, so many people... Oh, so many other things happening. <laughs> okay. And malaria and so many other things it's work. Happening. I've yeah. been working and, you know, I have auditors okay. on my neck in my store. Mm. They said if I don't produce the results, they will, they will fire me. But I wanted to mention that I know a young man that actually traveled and he served in Bauchi. As a result of that, he became a big-time farmer in beans. You know, there is not, it's not really all... Um, What's it called? A sad tale. A lot of people have actually come out successful, you know, in farming. And the truth is, anybody that can provide food to any nation, the person owns that nation. Right. So we need to go back to agriculture. I gotta tell you something, people. What's that? This, this tea is, is fantastic. <laughs> I agree. You know, you know, because it's painful that we spend so much money buying this in the, the foreign one. Imported one. And here is Zobo. With the lemon and and uh, and honey, Gin, honey, and I'm thinking all natural, no process, all natural, yeah, and it's so good. We need to really look into looking. We need to go back. We, really we need do. to look up because we are we are enriching other countries. Ah, there is we are a, enriching. What's that other one that they drink? The alcohol one. The one that's white. The one that do on the pop. The, the palm, palm wine. wine. Okay. You, you know, know like my like farm brings out the best palm wine. I think. Ever. Yeah, yeah. You you were supplied my brother before. Imagine. <laughs> we cut that. I can't drinks. ask. I can't request a palm wine on the set. I was just after. <laughs> so we need to encourage the government. We need to, to do yes. what they ought to do to encourage people who, who want yes. to farm. Yes. To be able to. It's do very it. important. Let's take a break. Mm. Good stuff, man. <laughs> Can't get over well it. Well done to me, okay. Let's take a break. When we come back, <laughs> we'll look at the front pages of the newspaper. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your view will be right back. Welcome back. Elf, FG uncovers massive fraud in Niger Delta Ministry projects. 422, sorry, 423 billion spent in six years. Hmm. Execution rate, 12%. Hmm. Some contractors allocated money without going to site. Hmm. Picture here how naval men attacked Cross River Police Station, says resident. Presidency Ganduje, uh, Ganduje expressed shock as gunmen abduct Kano Rep. Masqueraders attack Muslims in Ekiti, destroy mosque and others. FG plans to teach maths sciences in local languages. Yeah. Government's wrong to keep Dasuki El Zakzaki in detention, says Sands. Jam withholds over 76,000 UTME results over malpractices. And police arrest three suspected kidnappers of Lagos peoples. Let's say the many human, stories. yeah, so many yeah. stories. I just wanted to quickly talk on the human angle. The na naval um, officer, mm. um, from the reports that I read, they said he, he plotted, um, what's it called, a traffic, traffic, rule. traffic rule, and he was shot in his sh uh, on his shoulder. Then um, some naval guys came with machine guns. They went to the police station. They came out from the gutters. They went to the police station, and they shot two policemen dead. Then they shot one in the eye. And um, I think it was some form of a reprisal attack. Yeah, but know. why did the police shoot the naval? Shoot the naval officer. That's what we don't know. No, no, because yes, oh, we, we traffic rules. We, we, it was oh. in the story in yes, our story yes. yesterday, and yeah. what had happened was the yellow fever stopped him. Mm. 
then the never they started to beat the yellow fever when another policeman arrived arrived so i think that, in that must have been the other guy in defense of the yellow well, fever well, you we can't, dwell, we can't dwell too much on that. Let's move on to another story. Two wrongs don't make it right. Um, um, the masqueraders. The Muslim, yes. Yeah. They were having the uh, Maghrib uh, prayers at uh, 7.30. And um, the masqueraders attacked them because according to them, they were making noise. Now, mm. interestingly, the Oba, Oba Olatunde uh, Olushala, had actually written to the Muslims, Muslims saying, listen, the masqueraders are coming at this time. Please keep the women away. But they didn't ask them not to continue no, no. their prayers. Yeah, they, they said they shouldn't make noise. They shouldn't make noise. Because the noise will now uh, uh, incite the, the masquerade. The masquerade. Yes. But when they, I think at 646, they did they call their call to prayer. Their call procession. To prayer, yeah. No, the masquerade said their procession. Mm. When the, the Muslims, uh, Muslims now started at prayer. around yeah. 640. Mm. Almost 7 o'clock. Uh, almost 7. Eh? I don't know, in shock. He locked all of them inside the... They beat up the imam. They, they first beat them up. Then mm. those ones locked themselves inside the mosque. mosque. So well, they stayed well, there. Well, they are vandalizing two cars. They said, the Muslims said that they called the police. Police didn't answer them. Hmm. Well, no fire I think the, for four the hours. The Oba actually was trying to avoid this. That's why he wrote a letter to them. So mm. um, in this kind they of situation... They should have added. Yeah, to, to that. They should have. Moving on Which to the one nation. Which stands stronger? Well, I don't know. Just the all, nation. Or just all live in peace. Three arrested in Edo for kidnap of Lagos. Well, we should condemn it, though. It's mm -hmm. wrong. They shouldn't have. I mean, yeah. yeah. The masquerades are still human beings. Mm -hmm. So they should obey. They should do things within yeah. the confines yeah. of the law. But so what had happened was the mosque is very near the shrine. Right. Uh -huh. Right. And even the Obad advised them to go to a different mosque. That mosque. That's true. You're right. Mm -hmm. Moving on to the nation. Mm -hmm. Three arrested in Edo for kidnap of Lagos pupils. Masqueraders unleash violence in Ekiti. 423 billion Niger Delta contracts for probe. And Oshimbajo gives Lagos nod to fix airport road. Let's talk about the Lagos peoples. Peoples, yes, you um, have that story. So the um, IGP Idris had ordered the IRT intelligence um, response team to help the Lagos State Police Command rescue students of the um, Igola Model College. College, Model College in Lagos, in Ekwe. And so. Um, based on intelligence mm. they escorted they met some three and i'm going to read their names okay three of the kidnappers in their in the creeks they had, they had gone to visit one of their friends who had okay. been injured i don't want to spend time on that but one, 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 bottom line they're working on it and at least we're happy that the police is pretty much working on this matter Hopefully, i wanted to mention the name of the suspect right uh, agelu aka juby 25 um stanley powell 25 and Ovia Bentel, 24. All right. Okay. All 20, 20, 20, 25, kids. 24. So hopefully the kids get um, released really soon. Yeah. Now, I'm excited for Lagos State. Oh. Finally, um, the acting president, Yemi Oshibanjo, has approved that um, um, Governor Ambode takes over the Lagos Airport. Rehabilitation. Rehabilitation of the Oshodi Airport Road. Amazing. Because that is like the point of call for anybody that is coming into the country. And it tells the people that these are serious people. Right. I don't know why we've not been able to put priority on our airports and the roads right. that links to the airport because so, i mean first entry uh, so i'm excited for and hopefully because he had promised that um as soon as the government approves in two weeks uh, they should move to site and he signed work. it up on thursday yeah and they yes, should remember all the other roads too because when you enter you only see one fine road and you go no, and the address no, you, you have to give it to him yeah, now, but uh, he's been doing a lot of roads. internal i'm roads. not even talking I'm, I'm not saying he's not doing Generally. it i'm just saying okay. That while they are doing that one, they should remember all the other roads. Right. Because Daily the are actually exposing all the other roads. Mm -hmm. Daily Sun. Reps secure release of kidnapped lawyer. Uh, Ambody gets not for reconstructing the Lagos Airport Road. We talked about that. Police arrest kidnappers of Lagos students. New law. Okay, only career customs personnel. As Controller General, I read that story. Mm -hmm. Buhari's health. No cause for alarm, says federal government. AGF under fire over restructuring and Biafra Republic near. Yeah, let's take the... Boy, 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 so, so while well, uh, in the State House, after um, the FEC meeting yesterday, newsmen were speaking to the Minister of Information and Culture, Lajilai Mohamed, and asked after the President, and he said, don't worry about the President, he's in very, very competent hands where he is. And my response to that statement is, we're very grateful that our President is able to get... Competent hands. Effective... <laughs> and right treatment mm. from competent hands. Mm. The rest of Nigerians, however, are in very incompetent, incompetent hands. You mean highly 
<laughs> Highly. <laughs> um, <laughs> all right. But <laughs> I was listening to the radio when he was talking, and he said, "Don't go and say what I didn't say. Oh. <laughs> this is what I've said. I don't let me go and see any other headline." <laughs> yeah. well, well, as because said, Alaji Lai Mohammed needs to attend Luth. Mm. for him to appreciate what the rest of Nigerians are going yeah, through. Yeah. Our president ought to show leadership mm. by ensuring that our hospitals are in a state that we all yeah. can use. When a nurse will leave it for two hours in pain first. Yes, no. And mm. come back. Now, see if it's and there's even the current squabble happening in Louvre. In Louvre, right. yes. Between the Let's, management wanted, and the doctors. I want to talk about another story. Yeah. Um, the, 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 the Senate the finally, they, the, they amended, they amended an act. Remember they had the issue, they, the face of the had mm. the yeah, Controller we, General. Yes, and I mean. it was an outsider mm -hmm. that the yes. President appointed. Yes. Now they've changed the act to say that you can only appoint an insider to be Controller General. Now, that we, the issue with that, of course, was the fact that in the past, they felt that the, there was a rot in the system. Yeah. And they had an outsider to take a, 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 a new look to see how they can clean up the system. But they're now saying it's completely illegal and all... All the uh, leaders of that of that uh, uh, must go through the Senate approval. All the DGs, the Controller General must all pass but through I the Senate approval. I think it's a fantastic approval. idea that I, yeah, I, rise, okay. I rise through the ranks and if I have proven myself worthy to attain the, the, the highest... Nobody's uh, objecting. Well, but you hear what Murayo said. But mm. what if you are the, the most rot, corrupt person? The rot in the, in the, custom, in the custom system mm. is why they appointed an outsider. outsider. Then I but is it changing the rot? Yes, well, now. We're well, saying results. Hey, will it change? Uh, uh, yeah, I, I guess it is. Can't you see that? that, that We're well, saying see results. All the, all all the ammunition, ammunition. Yeah, and, and the rice that, that they are. They, 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 After that, then what? Uh, but anyway, Shad, what I was going to just say, <laughs> please, what happened when they said that you should wear a uniform to go and meet them? <laughs> yeah, no, she has never refused. <laughs> uh, but the everything is going on as normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They you can make too. noise. It will. Yeah. 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 They should focus on everything will go system quiet. System upgrade, not okay. individual. Moving on to Vanguard. They clean out the system, it will work. <laughs> Herdsman <laughs> attacks another Boko Haram, says Senate. Uh, law, Lagos school kidnap, breath, uh, breakthrough as police arrest three suspects. Worry incompetent hands talked about that already. Sit at home, massive discontent. Elite hypocrisy fueling Biafran agitation. And um, federal governments will turn cultural heritage to money spinner. Who read Vanguard? No. Headsman. I read it. Okay, go ahead. Ah, um, uh, yes. So the Senate yesterday in plenary were saying that Headsman attack has taken on the role of Boko Haram attacks in Nigeria and that the Inspector General of Police should decisively handle headsmen right now. Mm. They were um, commiserating with victims of headsmen attack in Edo Senatorial right. District, you know, and saying that this is totally unacceptable. We need to deal with this security issue as soon as possible. Okay, mm. let's move. Two um, women were raped and killed, strangled right. to death by oh, the headsmen hmm. in let's take, our Ishan, yeah, Ishan in mm. let's take our final paper, which is this day. With 49 trillion import bill, FG looks inward for goods and services. Equities market gains 1.3 trillion in May as sustained investor confidence. Jenko's days of unruly antics by discos are over. And Harris Holdings board appoints Norum Group CEO. This uh, Jenko is saying that uh, discos, that the days of the antics will be over. I hope so because me for a whole five days, we've not had the electricity. D and they didn't tell you that they weren't Nothing. going to be. You haven't? No. Five days. <laughs> you haven't? You have electricity. <laughs> my goodness. <laughs> like they did. London. Oh, okay. <laughs> my goodness. Did they even blink the light? Not at all. Not at all. Well, <laughs> if, 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 if they have to. Maybe just 30 what, minutes or 30 15 minutes. minutes and then ah. they have light. Well, maybe they've I mean, swapped because it means five days. I like my life for you. I like my life for you. And we it is have light. it is very very unusual. I don't understand. We're not used to this. We, are, we live in London in my area. Uh, really? Uh, London. Uh, please, please, please. please. I want to get to. Please, uh. what's your disco's name? Let's praise them. Get your disco. That's all we can. Oh, please. I beg. 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 Truly the most unfaithful wives. Hmm. Find out more after the break. Stay with us, we'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your view will be right back.
thanks for staying with us. So when it comes to infidelity, it is widely believed that men are more likely to stray than their female counterparts. But according to study carried out by Durex, out of 36 countries, it was revealed that a whopping 62% of Nigeria women were reported loud. to have cheated, <laughs> making them uh, <laughs> thought to be the most unfaithful wives in the world. Mm. We hear every day of married women's infidelities around us. We also hear of fathers who complain about finding out that the children they have yeah, aren't theirs. Mm. How true is this research carried out by Durex? You can call us on 070-8066-8014. You can also tweet to us at TVC uh, Connect. Please hashtag your view TVC so we can read your tweets. When people say that women cheat, I find it really hard to believe. Mm. Because I have that mentality that, listen, every woman wants her home. Every woman wants to build a marriage. Every woman wants to have, well, has, have a children, see them grow up. No, no woman would want to intentionally cheat. It's possible that circumstances within that marriage push us to that point. But I, don't, I, I, I find it so hard to believe. But when I now hear statistics like this, or hear stories from different, different um, um, angles saying that women actually do cheat, I find it very bizarre. I read the research that they sent to us, and they were, they were interviewing some men, and the men were like, like, like my wife of 20 years, cannot, I trust her. I can't <laughs> so I was laughing, because if the statistics, statistics are to be believed, mm -hmm. those men are living in denial, fool's paradise. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> they are living in a fool's paradise. So, But do you believe that, YK? I, um, I, don't, I, don't, I don't, because we can question these research, these statistics. And that's where I wanted to start from. Right, go, go ahead. ahead. You, yes, I think you can question the research, but I have seen, I have actually experienced a lot of this kind of things. Of this kind of thing. I'll give you an example of something that is happening right before my eyes now. Mm. The man was caught for, the wife caught the husband cheating. Right. Mm. The man is probably still cheating. Now the woman has her boyfriend that she sees on a regular basis. And the man is, he has no idea yeah. because she's so smart. Because mm -hmm. Nigerian women will give it to them. They are smart. If ah. they want to be smart, hey, you can't catch them. Okay. You, if, you catch, you know, if you catch somebody here, you haven't caught them. I didn't do it. Like right. okay. from, from your experience, it may be possible. I was going to question the statistics and say, who again is Durex? Who did they interview? Nigerian women abroad or yeah, in Nigeria, exactly. I did God not hear you. of this survey. Uh -uh. Uh -huh. But um, to be realistic, a woman will not come and sit on this couch now and tell you, ah, I'm cheating on my husband. Uh -uh. Even if I cheated yesterday. Uh -huh. <laughs> so th there's a possibility that it is happening without us knowing about it. But the much that we know, why are Nigerian women cheating? Um, secondly, we have a huge population. So when you think of our percentage, 10% um, of Nigerian women can be the population of the women in another country. So if you are comparing us to other countries, it will seem like more Nigerian women are cheats these days. Thirdly, when our culture makes it seem okay, if a man cheats, they say, eh, he has begged you. Women now with exposure and education feel slighted and they're playing the game, telling the men who can play the game. Right. You know. But now, going back to the reason why women do cheat, because, I mean, obviously we can, there, there are so many factors that lead to a woman deciding to go outside. Mm. Um, I don't I want what to touch on, on, on that. I wanted to say that coming from the angle of, you know, why women cheat, if you, because you were reading the statistics and you said that a lot of men now find out that their children are not theirs. Yes. I know that in the, in the past, because of the pressure that a woman faces that she does not have a child, mm. most times, because these men will not go and see, seek medical help, because they just believe that they are fine, that it is the woman that has a problem. Mm -hmm. Women in, in the past started helping themselves, started helping themselves mm. to go and get children. You know, since you are looking for a child, right? You know, because, I mean, that is one reason that I know that a lot of women, you know, would have children out of, um, well, I mean, that is not their, their, their spouse's um, child. But you see, for a woman to cheat, mm. 
she must have some form. I'm not talking about, let us separate it too. I'm talking about real women, mm. not the ones that are jumping from pillar to post. But for a real woman to cheat, she must have some form of emotional connection that she's had over the years. There must be something that must have, she, she must have been deprived of in the home that she's not getting. That eventually she now seeks love because we are what the being revenge. of a woman. Yes, th that one I'm coming to that. The being of a woman, we are nurturing in nature. We, we, are, we are like mothers. So when you feel like, okay, something is not, not right in that environment, of course you look for it out, um, elsewhere. Then secondly, because of thirdly. this, oh, rather thirdly, mm. when men keep cheating all the time, mm. you know, if a woman now decides to cheat, of course she will not even look back. Although I'm in the school of thoughts with uh, YK, that if you want to cheat, right, it's better you are not under the roof of the, man. of the man. But then again, why is it that the man will cheat and he's still under the same roof with <laughs> me? It is, no, it is so unfair. It's we need to, yeah, it's too one-sided. Okay, let me come. Uh, uh, <coughs> because I, I want to first say, for, in my own opinion, one of the main reasons why Nigerian women cheat, and I don't think it has anything to do with promiscuity or they, are, they, like, they love sex or anything like that, I think it is financial. Mm. Most of them, they want to carry a designer bag, designer shoe, designer cap. Let me finish. A lot of the women that I have found or I have noticed are cheating, are collecting what their husbands cannot provide mm. for right. them. A lot of them. Right. That I know of many. Right. Right. That, and when you see the uh, because uh, uh, mm. A is wearing uh, Gucci dress, Gucci dress. Me self, I want to wear a Prada shoe. L let me finish. <laughs> mm? I, you, you can say you don't agree. Mm, no problem. Right. But okay. I, and then to answer you about if, why should the man be in the house? A woman, you have said it is built different right. to a man. A man gives, a woman receives. Right. <laughs> that is why. When, if you're in your house, your husband cheats, it's your women friends and your mother and everybody that will advise, stay, bend your home. Okay. If, Be beg him. Beg him. If you cheat, it is the man's friends that will say, ah! YK, YK, what happened? YK, YK, what happened to that culture of women being somewhat meek? Not meek in the, in, 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 in the negative sense, but meek in that, where we are the, the weaker vessel. We can we easily are, forgive. You know, we are, well, yeah, we're the forgiving to the type. Soft. So why, why is it that women these days are somewhat emboldened to say, you know what, I'm educated, I don't need this nonsense, I don't have to take this nonsense. Why, can we, yeah, why can we come back? Why can we come back? No, why can't we come back, even though you're educated? Why, why, why can't we come back to that part where no. we are still Listen, Mariah, calmer you, you than... You do not want to stay in a house with a woman that is emotionally hurt. Yes. I'm telling you. So if all the, all the years she's grown up and she's seen it to be like this woman is being oppressed based on what they're... Of course, she would come out and say, I can't take this from anybody. Right. I wanted to answer why, Okay. It might have... It might, it, see, you might say, yes, they want to wear Gucci shoes and all that. But I know that the nature of a woman is not for the, for, uh, the fun of saying that I want to wear Gucci shoes. Because it's not for that fun. I think it might have been from a place of, first of all, I want to survive. I want my children to, to have a better life. It must always come from a place of giving, giving um, what's it called? Ua. Giving life to somebody else. Mm. Then Ua. it can eventually grow into that the tea that we are drinking now is different from the tea that our mothers drank. <laughs> Let Ua. me just tell you. Maybe so the woman the way... of before that was thinking is different from the woman who wants to wear Gucci today. Yeah, no, oh. no, no. Maybe the women that um, Ua knows who cheats. Because there's a category of women like that who it is based on survival. There are also the category of women who is greed. No, I want afraid. to I want to be like my friends. Right. Yes. I was going to also reply you to say that in the days of our mothers who had cheating husbands, they did not have anywhere to go. An educated woman has a choice. Gotcha. Let me take this call from Shola. Mm. Shola, are you there? Yes, I'm there. Good morning. Thanks for calling. Go ahead, please. All right. Well, uh, to me, I don't have much to say than uh, the truth of the truth of the matter is that um my agents from nowadays there's no fear of god anymore it's like people are far away from god you know bible says the fear of god is the beginning of wisdom True. so if there's fear of god i believe so many marriages will be more successful look at the past you can see that there are more successful marriages than the present now now the women of nowadays from our one they are no more so they are not they are not so many ah, do you get empowerment yeah look i even put uh like Mr. Ibe's uh, issues 
as an example now. But I did got married successfully, and you know, with his husband, so many pictures, so many, whatever, all the interviews he had, he, she has done, she's like, my husband is this, my husband is that. Along the line, something went wrong. What went wrong, nobody knows. All right, I, guess I, I, want, to say, I want to answer Shola. Thank you very much, Shola. To say that, you see, and this is where the problem that I think comes up in this our society. When you talk about the fear of God, we are supposed to have religious leaders mm. that we look up to. Mm. When we now see so many things that they themselves are doing, uh -huh. then you now even wonder and question if there is a God. Because now, what is happening to us is that, because, you see, one person's action is more like a ripple effect on every other person's reaction. Mm. So a lot of people, we've heard of pastors dating yeah. girls, sleeping around. Of course, why would you not believe that there's a God? You won't believe that there's any fear of God right. if the person that's supposed to be the custodian of the word of okay, God I is doing back, things. I need to take a break very soon, but I need to go back to what Owa had said. Is it wrong, and I'll pose that question to you ladies, is it wrong for a woman to dare to dream? Yes, she married her husband poor. Mm. And for whatever reason, things are not looking good. Mm. And you just want a better future. And between both of you, I agree with you, Oga. There's this... Uh, Oh, baba, 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 over there. Baba, I'm, just, I'm just saying. <laughs> because a lot of women, it's no, wrong. No, no, it's wrong. No. We, 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 we all agree. I'm just saying that a lot of families compromise. No, no. Husbands and wives I come together to man, agree. But it's wrong. It's because wrong. the institution of marriage, regardless of what religion, yeah. there's a religious God that instituted the marriage. Right. So I think you should hold on to the tenets of, of your marriage, marriage okay. and worship Regardless. God. Don't, look, God will sort you out. Right. If you try to sort your, yourself out like Abraham and Sarah, that's how, how you have okay, Ishmael. Let's take a break. We're going to bring a man on Instead this couch to tell us his own perspective, to find out if his own wife is cheating on him. I'm just joking, but stay with us. We'll be right back. Stay tuned. Your view will be right back. Welcome back. So joining us to share his experience and his thoughts on the topic is a social reformer and author, Okeowo Alashoboni. Olashoboni. Oh, jeez, dang. I'm so sorry about that. You can call us on 070-80668-014. You can also tweet to us at TVC Connect. Please hashtag your beauty visitor. I feel so embarrassed. Highly embarrassed myself. Oh, right. Yoruba. Terry, so Olashoboni, thanks for joining us on the show. Thank you very much. We've been hearing that conversation and we're hearing that some, some, some company called Durex came up with some silly statistics. statistics saying that women, Nigerian women, China, I'm wondering which Nigerian women, is it Nigerian women in China or the one in uh, London? <laughs> we cannot be the Nigerian women we know here because we are very religious here. We go to church every Sunday, uh -huh. we are mosque on Fridays, yeah. we love our husbands, we want to see our children grow. So do you believe or agree with these statistics? And what are your thoughts on it generally? Uh, Nigeria holds a very um, strong position in the world. Mm -hmm. And I'm not religious, I'm mm. not a pastor. Okay. But I must tell you that uh, after going or seeing all these stuff happening in the world, I researched uh, extensively mm -hmm. into what could be the cause. Mm -hmm. And there was only one book mm. that could offer me the real answer, which is the Bible. Mm. I mean, for any smart person, you have to be able to balance everything. You mm. do a bit of Ifa, mm. a bit of... Uh, Islam, mm. a bit of Christianity. Mm. I didn't say I did all that, but I read all the history. I'm a philosopher. Okay. That's what I studied. Okay. And when I looked into the Bible, there is a particular point towards the revelations that said everything word for word, verbatim, as it is happening today. Mm, tell us about it. That is the revelations. Mm. And I said, if this thing has been pre-written, mm. it is human beings like you and I that will act those scripts. True. Very true. So, but you have not answered, though. Yeah. Yeah. So, so yeah. what it means is, wait, mm. what it means, is, philosophy will confuse you a little uh, bit. What it means is, whatever is happening today, right. or whatever we are hearing, has been foretold. Has been foretold okay. And some people would have to. So, do you agree? So, women do cheat? I agree. Totally. Okay. Why would a woman cheat? Let me ask you then. Um, that's tough, really. But uh, in this claim, I think it's a little bit of uh, social imbalance, lack of morals, and um, half education. Yeah, a whole lot of people are half-educated here. Uh, you won't see anybody that is truly educated, fully educated, who believes 
in the Hi. human perfection, a lady that would settle down for less, no matter what. Hmm. No matter what. I you are really a philosopher. I'm really, yeah. really tired. <laughs> yeah. 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 I know, uh -huh, because I know this very educated woman. That's all right. She was very educated. And I was in her house. And I was complaining about this woman that was cheating. I, you know, I noticed her countenance. Her countenance changed. And I was like, ah. but I continued ranting, Sha. About two, three years down the line. You found out. I found out the, the woman, not only was she cheating, she mm. was cheating with her husband's business partner, one allergy. Mm. And the last child that she had for the man wow. was the allergy's child. Wow. In addition. Educated woman. No? In addition. Business woman. No? Okay, mm. education mm. is a different level. In, in, in addition, mm -hmm. I know <laughs> a totally illiterate woman. And the only reason she has stayed faithful to her husband is because she's an illiterate. That if she was educated, she could not stay in such a marriage. Mm. So it's yeah, not right. about education. Right. We have found out that women <clears throat> will cheat for else. emotional reasons. Some of them is for sexual um, gratification, dissatisfaction with their financial. husbands. For others, it's financial. So different women, yeah, different yeah. reasons. But what? Let me Sorry. since as a, as a philosopher, I'm saying that this has been foretold and all that. Mm -hmm. What would you? So, so now, as the solution of this is also foretold, do you feel that this whole thing would, at some point, would, would it end? Would it end? Well, I mean, it's 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 amazing how all these religious um, parts of humanity agreed towards the end someday. Okay. That is, there is a beginning of okay. everything. Mm -hmm. There should be an end, mm -hmm. and towards the end, these are the things I don't like that will happen. Ah, yeah, if let, me ask, let me ask you one question. <laughs> If your wife, yes. uh, right now, if you get your wife that she's cheat, uh, cheating on you, yes. what would you do? Because mm -hmm. let's not let's leave philosophy aside. Honestly, maturity for me would come would come into place mm -hmm. because for every action or reaction, are you married? The, oh, twelve years. Wow. For every action and reaction, mm. there would always be a result. Okay. So for divorce, I mean, you want me to the end. The next thing would be divorce her, chase her away. Now. What happens to the kids? Mm. Now, what kind of addition am I adding on to the society? Ha, okay, you forgive My her. children, immediately. Ah. I might, I might, be so honest with you. Like one second, one second, one second. Let, let, me, let me finish. Yeah, it's no a, answer, hang on a second. Um, before I go to that question, <laughs> because, um, you have to think about what next true. into the society. Very true. So we have kidnappers today. We have prostitutes today. We have hand different, robbers. yeah, hand robbers, different dangerous people coming up. And these are products of, you know, broken divorces, homes. broken homes, and stuff like that. A lot that. of time. So you yeah. forgive your wife. I mean, predominantly. Okay, let's say, let me pause you for a second, and you answer why we uh, ask question. Yes. Let me take Benga Falaya's call. Benga, are you there? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Please go yes, ahead. Thanks for calling. Kola. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, this is Star Kola. Oh, welcome to the show. Hi, Benga. Welcome. Sorry, I don't want to disagree with this gentleman. Oh, sorry, <laughs> so who was asking you a question? Are you know, cheating your wife? Can I just quickly disagree with you? Yes. That you said all oh, products, um, actions and reactions. Uh, no, the arm robbers and mm. kidnappers are products of broken homes. So the politicians do, who are looting us, where, 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 where? Are stealing our, and stealing all our, our future. <laughs> They are probably uh, what? They are also products of broken <laughs> they are not. shops. Mostly. How do you know? No, they are more products. Do you know? Mostly they are they are dysfunctional people. Yeah. Dysfunctional, yeah. dysfunctional yeah. people. Oh, to be honest oh. with you. Because you know why I'm asking if you're cheating? Because you see, it, it, it's a different ball game if you are not cheating on your spouse and you say, okay, if she cheats on you, you will forgive I will her. forgive. Usually, if a man is cheating on his wife, right? And finds out that she's cheating on him. It's easier to forgive. It's easier to just, you know, let go after all. Miss mm -hmm. I'm doing it. Mm -hmm. Yes. But if a man is faithful to the wife, mm -hmm. and, it will break and him. he now finds her out that she's cheating it's on well him, out. uncle. It so are you cheating him. on your wife? No. No, she. Well, okay, we so need to tell you. <laughs> I don't know what <laughs> 20 minutes ago. Okay, question. <laughs> Let me take a while. We, who will be cheating? I say, I'm cheating. I'm yes. Not, I'm, it's I'm, fine. I'm, yes. Okay. I'm I'm a cheat. Let me take a while. Olabi, are you there? I think if they come to Nigeria to so do their statistic again, yeah. I think they will give Nigeria 99%. Ah. <laughs> 99%. <laughs> I'm telling you. Okay, bye. Uh, come Olabi. on. Oh, wait, wait, wait. What is this? 
There are four women on this table. Come on. Ah, ah, oh. ah, he said that you forget is cheating. Ah, oh. 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 You forget is not married. Why you don't call yourself? You forget is not married. Well, listen, I want us to drive this. Yes. Because we don't want to just gist about it. Yes. We want to, first of all, let people know that possibly it exists and what homes can do to resolve when a spouse, we don't talk on the men because we talked about men several times. Yes. When your wife is cheating, yes. we, I like the part you put in of the maturity. Yes. It's important because when you think of what your children might end up being yes. as a result of this See, broken Mariah, marriage. Yes. Let me be honest with you, okay? If we all here believe marriage is sacred, mm -hmm. do we all believe that? Yes. yes. Do we believe marriage is an institution? Yes. yes. Created now, by God. Created by the creator. That's God. Now, what it means is, what are the products of a marriage? Children. That's what, children. The blessings or, you know, the tenets that follow marriages would be good children or bad children. Mm -hmm. Now, for any woman married under that umbrella of God, that yeah. institution, yeah. to step out of that institution, mm -hmm. you're already bringing something else into that, um, into that what lineage, is, what actually. What about the man? To you say for anybody that leaves that be, marriage and steps out to do something contrary. Be honest with you. Be honest with you, uh, Ua. You and I know from all the religious books we've read, mm. philosophical books, everything from experience, men are naturally polygamous. Mm. Who came up with this? I mean, it is I know, it's, I'm sorry, mm. my own husband is not polygamous. We don't no, we are naturally. I'm not saying you say we husband. will. I'm just saying. And nobody, I mean, when the they say husband all is cheating, men are polygamous. Yeah. Like but, like you know, but polygamous. let me be honest with you. Why would I want to cheat on my wife when she's all sufficient? She's a mother to me. Ah, Women, hang on ah, a second. A Women, a... no, what I mean mother. All sufficient. All sufficient. Women are, if, if you know who a woman is, you would fear yourselves. Women are creatures, powerful. powerful creatures mm -hmm. that, oh yeah, called Gilaro, you know, you'll be we pouring know, libation we on know. women. Okay, I think I now, to for a woman to lower her degree and lower everything about her and to do these things, oh. uh, I, I don't think it's... No, uh, I have a question. Let's okay. Let me let you okay. <laughs> Hello, are you there? Hello? Hello? Are you still there? Yes, I am, I am, Please I am. Please go ahead. Thanks uh, good for morning. calling. Good morning. Good morning. I will listen to what you guys have been saying all day, and I think the major issue is um, our, our culture. First and foremost, we should know that um, it's very difficult for us, in, um, for women in Nigeria, to instigate divorce or marital violence or issues like that. No, in, like I'm guessing from Durex, um, most of, um, there's no way they won't look at America or Europe or the likes. These are places with legislations that hate women to come out for, from um, um, marriages that are not uh, suitable for them. Well, because mm -hmm. here, down here in Nigeria, it, 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 it seems like you're a bad egg if you come, if you like, d decide to divorce. Right. It means you want mm -hmm. to um, go to um, find other resorts. Right. So everything that you guys are saying seems the factors that are behind why people try women okay. cheat. Yes, it's there. Right. The year, because of money, sexual gratification, right. blah, blah, blah. Exactly. Thank you very much, Mwa. Let's let me let Jumoke come in. Olu Kotsun, Olu Ashegu says, people don't prepare for marriages anymore. Mm -hmm. It's about the flamboyant weddings. Mm -hmm. It's basically lost. Mm -hmm. And money-driven unions, then revelations later. Mm -hmm. My question is, how do we prevent men and women from cheating let's focus on women is it, around. Don't men is it times. pre marital counseling <sighs> counseling within marriage is said open communication because we have found out that women do cheat hmm. what can we do to prevent it i i think it's a it's a sad and um, you know events i mean what how do i call it now situation situation when women debase themselves to such level. We agree. Do you understand? We so agree. the best way we can uh, try to prevent mm -hmm. this is for us here, mm. let us start with our kids. Mm. Start inculcating values of being, I mean, one day I saw my wife and my kids on Okada mm. because my wife's car had a problem. Mm -hmm. She had to park and she put them on a bike and I got so mad. When I when they got home I sat my kids and I said, see you guys can't get on these things. And they were like, why? We like it fast. It's, so see, you are kings and you are a queen. You know, you have to understand that you don't just do anything. Mm -hmm. 
you okay. need to hold values as a human being right. mm. and as a, me, you know. Let's take a quick break because right. I have to mm. take a commercial. When we come back, I still want us to drive this to solution. I'm not talking Because we need, we need a situation <laughs> where, uh, when, a woman, when a woman cheats, <laughs> how does a spouse handle it? Especially in the interest of the children. I want us to focus on that. Stay with us. We'll be right back. Mm. Stay tuned. Your view. Welcome back. Why can't you give us one hot just yet? I can't, I can't <laughs> say from here. No. But, um, ah. but you know, I, we have to bring this home because, as I said, women who cheat, there's some women right now that have children hmm. mm. that don't belong to their husbands. Hmm. You know, in that kind of situation, as a, as a philosopher, oh, statistics, I mean, I, I don't want you, I, I don't know if you're mm -hmm. the right person for this kind of conversation, but the truth is that what does that, what, what, what can that man do? To handle a situation where you know your wife, your, the children you have don't belong to you, and you find out that your wife is cheating, how would you advise Mariah, men in that situation to handle it? Thank you very much, Mariah. Mm -hmm. Do we uh, all remember the Pythagoras law or something? Mm -hmm. right. Where there is one simple um, equation formula. formula. Thank you. That solves everything. Yes. Almighty formula. Almighty yeah. formula. Pi. Uh -huh. mm. Pi some is on me raised to pass on, but yes. I wasn't a Pi good. R squared. Pi R squared. Yes. I the same science. almighty formula is there that solves all the issues of life. Which is God, I mean. Which is just God. believe Why in. Why is it so predictable, though? You know, just. It be, Yoruba I'm people say, hold on, YK. Yoruba <laughs> people say, Ibi Kwelebe Latin Jolly. When you make things very easy for yourself, mm. things will be easy for you. Now, mm. let me be honest with you. Mm. The end justifies the means, right. says mm. in philosophy and law, yeah. which guides the world. Mm. Whatever the product of your action will bring is mm. what you should think of before you embark mm. on that action. Okay. Now, when you start to cheat and start to raise other children in another man's homes, what are the products of these yes, actions? Right. Okay. okay, the people who do it do not care about. Uh, hey, hey. Exactly. now you are talking, YK. So Which now, brings me. Okay, go ahead, Jim. Okay. I was going to say that it's not like the woman who is chasing does not know that what she's doing is wrong. It's wrong. Mm. I know a woman when she used to fight her husband regularly because it is poor today, yellow tomorrow. You don't even have teeth. Mm. So when the issue now became that you will die of hypertension, mm. she now stopped shouting. Since she knew that the man will come in at 12 midnight, she will go her own and come in at 11 p.m. Thank you. And she stopped complaining because she said was now enjoying, to her, she was enjoying herself. But we know that women are not built like that. That's not God enjoyment. God bless you. Two wrongs God do not make you it right. I would have wanted someone to tell us about prevention. But now we know that is happening. What's the solution for homes like that? Okay, it has been foretold, Oga. But we do not want our children raised in families like that and believing that it is okay. When a woman is cheating on her husband or the, the daughter is from another man, how is she going to advise that daughter God when she's going you. to God her own you. husband's I mean, house? What prompted me to come on this show is when I watch you guys in the morning, right. yes. I hear so much values. Mm -hmm. I'm so, so happy. Ah, come on, you guys can change the world. Right. Together we can change this society. Right. Yes. Let all the women know yes. that the end product of these things it's not nice, so exactly, and that's why and we found ourselves that, that's with very, these kind of politicians you. that YK was saying. Yes, that's these are the products of these politicians, the product of this kidnapping, and the product of the Nigeria that we're going to. We're going to. I, 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 I must talk. No, 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 uh -huh. no. no. I think quiet. what I've gotten, I can't keep quiet. what I've, what I've gotten <laughs> from, from the crux of this conversation, really, is that before you decide to cheat, weigh the options. Mm. Before you say, okay, I want to cheat, I want to have another. Uh, no. At the end product of Mariah. my children, Mariah. what's going to happen to me? Am I financially stable? Mariah, should I tell you something that men do, which right. I'm not advocating for? Mm. All throughout our lives, from mm. adolescent to when we are 60, mm. that's when we are tired. Mm -hmm. We are as active as you can think of, which right. means we will meet all man. I travel sometimes six months, I'm in the U.S., another five months, I'm in London, and my wife and kids are here. Uh -uh. You can imagine also, the amount of women. Trust me, I can swear on my life. I just face my work. And I'm so engrossed with my second wife is work. All right. But let imagine. Me, let me pause you. Who are those who believe you? Who are 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 you
so sorry. Well, I, may I quickly pick oh, uh, three categories of women so that we are looking at the um, solutions in particular. The woman who is cheating because her husband has lost his job, she doesn't want her children like, to no, leave no, school. Uh, uh, hey, she doesn't want her children to leave school. What's the solution for that woman? The woman who her husband loves her, but she's not sexually satisfied right. in the house. She has mentioned she it, he has tried. So what's the solution for okay. that one? The promiscuous woman. Mm -hmm. I don't have There's another solution. category mm -hmm. you're missing. Mm -hmm. The one that is emotionally hurt mm -hmm. as a hey. result of the spouse cheating, cheating on, on her. her. Ah. Now wanting to pay back. Uh -huh. hey. What is so, that category? Um, she should find God. Can't say <laughs> Are you are you believing well, that? For solutions, are you uh, believing uh, that? Okay, okay, let him respond. Am I believing that? Yes. That she should find God. Thank you. Mm. See, Uwa, be, like before I came, I mean, first thing I said is for every uh, answer to anything or result, there are premises. Mm. So what is if I'm if we put all ourselves in a car now, mm. if you don't ask me where we're going, then there's a problem. Yes, I must tell you our destination right. before we leave this place. Right. Yes. What is the end product of your action. Right. So whoever is setting you up, I don't want to talk on TV yeah. as a Christian or whatever, mm -hmm. whoever is setting you up to do these things, what has it person preempt or has planned for you to end up with okay, before you start? You have to take some no, questions. Hairfire. Uh, it's a possibility. God bless you. The man, the man discovered his wife was cheating when he got there and saw his wife's picture on, on another, another man's, man's table. table. And said, ah, who is that? He said, my wife. He said, hey, it resembles my wife, too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, what? In fact, to the woman who is not, two men. To the woman who is emotionally broken, that yeah. one, I think she needs counseling. counseling. Yes. She needs to get yes. real professional yes. therapy yes. to help her through. The woman who is not sexually satisfied, there are things you can use now. Mm -hmm. There are things you can use to get that. Uh, uh, many, many things. Mm -hmm. So you can always help your husband. Help your husband also. Get counseling too. Because yeah. the there, husband there needs to your husband can use. Yes. 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 Yeah. To help yeah. himself. Yeah. Yeah. I don't know. The yeah. one finance. Financing. That one, eh? Go to church. No, who put <laughs> you, no, you, who no, put you under that kind of pressure? Who brought you to that place to I believe in that? In, see, you can't, first of all, you can't even survive in Nigeria today without being financially empowered. Right. Yes. Because everything is so every, commercial. Yes, it's not like somewhere else in the world where you can even where go you somewhere have a system where they will feed you. Yes. Or even house you. True. Bill Keys, let's take as many as we can as we run off, says, I think most women cheat for different reasons. Emotional deprivation, financial gain, sexual gratification, and a revenge cheat. Um, Ibrahim Belu, almighty formula. <laughs> y equals to minus B plus minus 4AC squared slash 2B your view. I agree, I agree with all your points from YK. <laughs> Patrick says, can somebody tell Jumoke that R2 is not the almighty formula? Uh, pi R squared is not the almighty. I'm coming from... I am coming for your certificate. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that was, that was, that was, no, no doubt, because you can never satisfy Nigerian women. And the one spot uh, of it is they don't know what. This is our model mm. says, Murai, yo, you are deceiving yourself. If you think your husband is not polygamous, ah. then, then he exhibits the nature. You will collapse. <laughs> Ajayi you Samuel says, I'll tell you that the unfaithfulness of most men makes women unfaithful. That all the says, may, maybe, be, uh, may be correct, because women are. Uh, women be feeding boys noodles and expect to have anything better than one minute men. And he says, <laughs> who are, sorry, and he says, who is wrong? It doesn't take an unfaithful man to forgive. The truth is that an unfaithful man will easily forgive. All right, well, that's, that's your own. That's my theory. So, sir, give us a final word on this. Just a final word. Okay, my final word on this is my take is we have to understand for us to have a good country, for us to have good families, everybody has to hold sanctity. Mm. We all have, no matter what we think of, we all have to be one way or the other religious mm. and hold on to the values of the Creator right. that we should live with. Religious Fantastic. rather than spiritual, because we are all religious. Okay. Maybe spiritual. Thank you so much. That's okay. all we can Maybe take. spiritual. Sure. Thank you so much, <laughs> sir, for being here. We had, uh, I think we learned quite a bit from you today. Yeah. Thank you. Have a lovely day. See you again tomorrow. <laughs> Bye. -bye. <laughs> Don't cheat on your spouse.